I'm a Frost fans. I'm gonna welcome back to the video. And guys, and guys, what? And guys, and guys, and guys, what I'm gonna be doing in this video, guys? I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys can get infinite of the brand new Inferno event cards on the on the tournament. It's gonna be really cool. All right, I'm a Frost fans. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit 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 the like button or hit the like button below. Hit the subscribe button if you got a new channel. Hit the little bell. Like guys, know whenever I post a video. And guys, uh, if you guys like to follow me on Supercard, come on, baby, come on, come on, baby, come on, come on, baby, come on. Come on, baby, come on. Come on, baby, come on. All right, I'm a Frost fan, so if you guys like to follow me on Supercard, just type just type in uh, Peyton, 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 Peyton Frost Alert Case. But remember, if, there, if there's space there, if, there, if, there's space, if there's a space after my name, you guys won't be able to find me. But 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 if you type, but, but if you type my name, all, all, all one, all one, all one word with that is space, then, then, you guys, then, then you guys find me at Supercard, and, and you can type in, and you can type my name, Alert, 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 Alert Case, or All Uppercase. Either way works. And guys, um, if if you get if 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 you get if if you guys like to get a, a quick a quick shot a quick shot my YouTube channel, just 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 write me just write just write me in Supercard or guys write me in YouTube. But remember, but remember in your YouTube you YouTube 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 comment, just 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 write just write just write, just write just write, just write Supercard names. It'll be a lot easier to find you guys. All right, guys, let's do a quick shout out to KMC. But got but guys go but got but got but guys. But, you guys go check him out on Supercard. He's a he's a he's a fantastic guy. He's an all Supercard player. He's a fantastic friend. Here's here's card. Here's 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 his cards are very perfect. Time to keep keep the fantastic work, keep being awesome. Here's team as well. Yes, I do check it out. All right, I'm a Frost fans. Here we go, guys. Are you guys ready? This is gonna be a lot of fun because I'm gonna show you guys how you guys can get infinite in, infinity of the brand new, I should say infinite, of the brand new Inferno uh tournament cards. Now there is a way to do it. But of course, though, you do have to actually get you have to get to a certain tier. I will say that there is there is a way to do it. So I will show you guys this real quick. So if you guys get to a certain tier, I would say about what about Royal Rumble tier? Would that would that be acceptable for it? Uh, well, I mean, if you upgrade it, maybe. But keep in mind, you can also get the Royal Rumble event cards. But I think you have to at least get to WrestleMania tier. Yes, I think you have to get to at least maybe WrestleMania tier, and then. And then Enigma tier, because as you guys know, whenever you guys get to the higher tiers, the stats will be a lot stronger whenever you upgrade them, as you guys know. Yes. Whenever you guys get to the certain cards in the game, yes. And then you'll be able to take on the Inferno cards, which, you know, the Inferno cards are insanely powerful. Yep. Yes, you must, I said, you have to at least, I think, get about to about WrestleMania 40 tier. Whenever you guys get to WrestleMania 40 tier, then you guys can actually... Then you guys can actually win the matches, which is cool. Yep. Okay, now let me show you guys a quick little like preview on how to get the tournament tokens. The best ways to do it is pretty much going to be in the store. Then you guys have Dungeon Smasher, and then you guys have the free packs where you guys where you guys get a whole bunch of tournament tokens. So make sure you guys claim your free packs. You guys get two of those every every day, like every after, well, every like four hours. And then and then of course then you guys can go to your quest. I think you got about you got you got about twenty one hours left for the quest. It's where you guys can actually get uh, 20 sword tokens and 20 crown coins, which is amazing. Yep. And then of course, and then and then of course, and then and then of course, and then and then of course, then you guys can actually then you guys can head over to your draft board and actually get a whole bunch of uh, sword tokens from the uh, from the uh, from with the draft picks stuff. And the best way to get draft picks is in the PvP Royal Rumble, male or female. And of course, the other way is getting a whole lot of super coins and the uh, yeah, money, 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 money. Money in the Bank, TBG, Team Summer Ground, PPP Campaign, and Bundles. And then, of course, then you guys have their website, www.supercar.com, where you guys get, like, three sword tokens every day, which is cool. And you guys can also do your uh, tag team takedown, which can actually give you uh, max wins of uh, two sword tokens every time and give you five crown coins. So every single time you guys win, you'll be able to get ten, ten sword tokens, which is cool. Yep. So guys, that is how you guys can do it. At least gave you guys a quick little idea on it. If you guys want to know, if you guys want to know more on how to get sword tokens, go check out my video. It's actually really cool. Okay. Now you guys want to know how to actually do this. So, but as I said though, so whenever you guys are WrestleMania, then get to Enigma, and then whenever you guys are those tier, then you guys can actually start facing the SummerSlam 24 cards, and then you guys can actually start getting the cards easier, which is cool. Yes. So, but yeah, make sure you guys go to Edit Your Deck Autofill. Make sure everything's good. Yeah, but as I said though, so whenever you guys are doing it, make sure. So, but yeah, when so whenever so so whenever so so whenever so whenever so whenever you guys get to a certain tier, which is actually rest 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 
WrestleMania 40 tier, Enigma tier, and then SummerSlam tier. Whenever you guys get to those tier, then you guys can face the SummerSlam cards. If you guys can face them, because even the abilities will give you good boosts and stuff, so that will actually help you guys out. Even though you have to play 10 matches each, it still gives you a good chance once once you guys like face the SummerSlam cards and win and get a pro. And then once you guys get those, then you guys can face the Inferno cards, which will give you a guaranteed Inferno card. And then you guys can use the Inferno cards in the other game modes and win those matches too, and including even like campaign and stuff too, which is amazing. So yeah, that's what's actually broken about this and what's actually cool. You and the reason and the reason why I say infinite of them, you guys see the number on the left hand side. I already have more than I can get more than ten. Let's say I can get like hundred or even a thousand. I don't, I don't think there's no limit to them, but the thing is, even though there's no limit to them, you have to uh, you have to spend so much time playing. I think the highest a lot of people have is probably at least like a couple hundred of them. So yeah, so you can get infinite of them. That's what I'm saying. You get like fully maxed out cards of like five fortifies of each. You know. You can have, like, an entire deck full of them. You can do that, which is up to you, of course. It's pretty cool, though. So let me show you guys the stats of, uh, I guess I'll show you guys the stats of the Damian Priest. Yeah, we'll do that. So you guys will see the base stats for him and, like, what's to, what cards you got to face. And I'll also give you an idea of what, like, what tier you kind of have to get to. But as I said, the tier you have to get to is pretty much the base stat of, like, WrestleMania to Enigma. If you guys get to those two tiers, two tiers, I think you guys have a chance. It should be about based on your cards or whatever, but keep in mind, the first thing you have to do is get to the Summer Slams. Whenever you guys get to the Summer Slams, yes, then you guys would definitely even st then you guys would definitely stand an even better chance of doing it. And then whenever you guys get the cards, you have to make sure you upgrade them, pro them, fortify them, do the variant, play all the matches. Yes, you have to do everything, add them to add them to the momentum slot, pretty much everything. And then you guys would have, then you guys would be able to get the SummerSlam cards maxed out, of course. And then then you guys can then you guys can play the matches in the Inferno. Yep, that's what makes this game mode so like so crazy powerful. It makes it just so much fun. And if you guys, um, yeah, it makes it insane. Yeah, that's what that's what's broken about it. And you guys see these abilities? You guys have you guys have all five different abilities. And then the sixth one, if you guys use the R Truth against Naomi and Priest. Then you unlock a 150% bonus. Yep. Yep. And but yeah, the these abilities can give you like different patterns you can that you can use in your in your fight against your opponent, of course. Well against the bosses and stuff like that, so you can win easier. That's what I'm saying. These abilities can actually help you guys out a lot easier. But of course, sometimes, but of course, sometimes though, they you may not get in a you may not get a uh, combo. But you can also use this this uh, combo, it's called a wild card. It's pretty much like it's pretty much just like an Uno. Pretty much, it's where you can use like a wild card to get any color you want. Like if it's like a blue color, like on the board, yeah, you can change it to like a blue color or something like that. Yeah, that's what they're pretty much like are. Yeah, they're pretty much a uh, blue or a uh, wild card. So in this, so in this, so in this instance, if you guys actually go to rewards, no wait, no, well edit deck, and then you guys can actually go to combo. See, this card, the cards in this in this deck are locked and it, it can't be so yes because it's a wild card and the same thing here and you and it said you can buy the next one for 250 credits but you guys can buy as many as you want but keep in mind every single time you guys buy one i believe it goes up more in price the first one was 150 the next one's 250 and the next one's probably gonna be like 350 450 or it could be like 500 or in, or even like 750 a thousand it could go up by like 150 250 or even it can go up a lot more just just letting you guys know but what it does it can make any arrow of it. It can make a. It can make. It can make. It can make. It can make a blue, yellow. It can make a yellow. Pretty much yellows and blues, left and right, up and down. Either way, it can make any. It can make all four of those arrows, pretty much, which is cool. Now, if you have all eight of them, yes, you can do the. You can do the master ability every single time. So I would say it costs you about maybe like, maybe like about like close to like, fifty bucks at least. It's not too expensive, so you get like. So if you get at least like fifty bucks in credits, it might only be like twenty. You never know. And if you guys have all those arrows, you can literally get all these cards for pretty much easy. Even even if you guys have like the highest tier, the best tier, the tier you want to get to is WrestleMania tier at least. And whenever you guys get to that, you have, and you guys be able to win every match if you, even if you did that as well. So that's also a cheat sheet right there. You guys can use. It's almost like a cheat code pretty much. So yeah, that's what's that's what's crazy about it. Hey, look, we actually have all three, and the stats for the SummerSlam ones are about the same. 
was well they're not as the same but they're a little bit you know a little bit different than these ones because these are your three big boys you have the damian praise ellie knight bianca belair then of course and then of course then you have r-truth becky lynch and Braun Strowman. but of course the female ones are always going to be tough you know what i mean so yeah that's also where the event cards also come into play as well but yeah but the, uh, there are a few little cheat codes in this that you guys can use, like getting to a certain tier and then getting the Summer Slams for the base ones and then proing them and everything, getting everything completed for those and then using those Summer Slams against the Inferno cards. So make sure you guys get at least a couple of those Summer Slam cards whenever you guys get to the uh, Dungeons, the Dungeons and Dropkicks Summer Slam cards. Get a couple of them, max them out, and then use them against the Inferno cards and get, ton and get tons of these pretty much. Pretty cool, right? That's how you can do it. That's 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 what's that's what's broken about it. It's pretty nuts. All right, but guys, though, if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments and let me know how many of these lit. Let me know how many Damian Priest, Ellie Knights, and, and Bianca Belair cards you guys have. Let me know. I'm gonna say you guys have at least probably like a couple hundred of them, maybe even a thousand, but you can get infinite of them. That's what I'm saying. You guys can get as many as you want. It's it's pretty cool. Anybody can do this. I didn't think about this. If you guys actually go to your puzzle rewards, keep in mind, you guys can also go to your throne hunter and actually get the first reward, which is actually Roman Reigns, and then you can use it in the mode. I forgot about this. Yeah, if you guys actually go check out my dice rolls, this can also be a combination of throne hunter because it's all free. You don't have to spend no credits. All it does is take time. And that's why I said if you guys get the sword tokens and crown coins, the sword tokens for the, for the tournament, and then the crown coins for the throne hunter, and then if you guys, if, if you guys watch my videos and the dice rolls and stuff, you guys can see how to do this, and you guys can get every single puzzle shard. You guys get the Roman Reigns J Cargo, and you can even get all the Cody Rhodes cards. Even if you guys are the lowest tier, you don't have to battle anybody on this. All you have to do is just get puzzle. All you have to do is get sword tokens, crown coins, and uh, and uh, and dice rolls, and you'll be able to get the and you'll be able to get the Cody Rhodes cards. The you'll be able to get the Roman Reigns J Cargo, Roman Reigns. Well, or Cody Rhodes, you'll be able to get all of them, and then you can use those cards in the tournament. I never thought about that. Yeah, you could do that. Yeah, if you guys actually do it. Yeah, if you actually, if you guys watch the whole, yeah, you can see how to do it. It's actually really cool. All right, I'm a frost. Sorry, I'm a frost fan. I hope, hope you guys hope, hope you guys, hope, hope you guys hope. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you guys have a hit, hit the hit, hit the hit the hit, hit the like button below. Hit the subscribe button if you got a new channel. Hit the little bell. It'll let guys know whenever I post a video. And guys, and guys, want you guys, and guys, always thank you, thank you guys, thank you, thank you guys, the thing. Thank you guys so much for all the support. It means a lot to me. And I hope, and I, and I hope, and I hope, and I hope, and I hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Friends doing good. But guys, but guys, but guys, but guys, but guys, always thank you for watching. I'll see you next one. Peace out. Love you.